At Sole, the electrons permanently circulate in the storage ring, producing synchrotron radiation. When the light leaves this ring, it is guided in laboratories set up around the ring, called beam lines. This is where the researchers come to run their experiments. They expose their sample to the beam. Through the various detectors installed around the sample, they can obtain information about its composition, about its chemical, magnetic and electronic properties, and about its structure. The light that allows researchers to obtain a lot of information is called white light. It contains all known colors, also called wavelengths, in the visible range, or in other words, all the colors of the rainbow. But it also contains invisible light, such as infrareds among the lowest energies, and ultraviolets and X-rays among the highest ones. Altogether, Soleil has 29 different beam lines. Each one of them is specialized in a type of experiment. For that, it only uses one small fraction of the light produced by the electrons, as the rest of the light is filtered. Certain beam lines only use X-rays, while others only use infrared or ultraviolet light. A great diversity of samples can be analyzed. This is why Soleil attracts many researchers from all scientific fields. 